what is happening fishers a very good morning to all of you so we are on our way to winter strand recreational club for round two of the bulmoria fishing classic series hosted by yours truly us at untraceable fishing and guys i hope it's going to be a good day for all of the anglers um, I know we've got quite a long drive from the east coast all the way through to the other side of town but it's going to be worth it but Dean what's the water been doing this week it's been an absolute mess the water has been crazy big guys we had extremely cold water then we had three days of crazy west wind and big surf we had seven eight meter waves crashing through on the rocks but since yesterday morning it swung to east and it seems to have tapered off so hopefully it's tapered off enough to be fishable i think it has been keeping an eye on it so the water looks good it will be big the guys will have to fish smartly but uh there should definitely be fish around guys yeah so we had to postpone from last weekend because of the extreme weather that we had yeah. and we moved it to this weekend but we can't postpone any further I think we've got quite a big field this morning and some interesting names that uh, came through. We've got some fellow YouTubers that are joining us, which is pretty great. So hopefully you pop them onto the video a bit later on. But anyway, guys, let's get to Winter Strand and get this show on the road. Cheers. What is happening, Fisho? So we are well underway for round two of the Bill Moria Classic Series out at Winter Strand. We've come down to Agoda and we're going to take a walk along the bricks and see if any fish have come out. Guys, follow me down. What's happening guys? So we're here with Connor. He was first on the scoreboard this morning. This morning. First fish to come through. Connor, you want to show them uh, what, you, what you got this morning? Yeah, sure. So we got a beautiful punsi. Black muscle cracker this morning. Um, beautiful, beautiful morning. It turned out a lot better than we thought. And even now the weather is so, so awesome. We're actually really blessed to have a good day like this. Um, awesome event from you guys as well. Sure, Thank we you very appreciate much. that. Dude. And yeah, hoping for, hoping for more coming out today. Yeah, guys, a bit of tricky conditions. Uh, the water is a bit off color for the species we are targeting, but the guys have done well. Uh, you mind sharing with what bait you got this guy on this morning? Yeah. So... I'm going to let a little secret out here, guys. We <laughs> got him for this morning. This morning's secret. We got him on some pili this morning. Very simple bait. Yeah. Yeah. Very Something nice bait. and smelly for the dirty water. Yes. Group. Yeah. Surprisingly, too, on pili, actually. Um, one would think on a, on a red bait that we catch it, but yeah. put him out on a, on a pili. Nice, nice. See, the boys are thirsty early in the morning. <laughs> After doing it, warm, we're kind of well done, bro. I hope you get some man. more fish. Awesome, thank you so much. Good luck to you guys, bro. Cool, bro. Cheers. What's happening, What's guys? <laughs> so, we're here with Justin from Hooking Jazza. He also runs a YouTube channel, fellow YouTuber and fisherman. Justin, good morning so far, bro. Good morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Beautiful, actually. Yeah, we see, um, yeah, as we came down here this morning, it's like clear skies. Oh, just beautiful, like almost no wind. Um, Big sea, so conditions yes. aren't the best. I see you dealing yeah, with some, some, some water here. Yeah, yeah, beautiful morning nevertheless though. Yeah, you guys chose a really good day to have us all out here. <laughs> yeah, we had, we had a cancel last weekend because yeah. we thought the weather was going to be worse. Yeah. Wasn't a great day last weekend. Uh, yeah. Sea is big, but uh, everyone's yeah. fishing the same conditions. So yeah. fair game, fish, guys. Fish are still there. Yep. So yeah, I've seen one or two nice fish come out on the, on the group that you guys have posted. So yeah, awesome. man, really awesome. Yeah. Anyway, guys, if you want to Go check out Justin's page, Hooking Jazza. Hooking Jazza. That's, That's it. it. Follow him on YouTube and give him a subscribe, guys. Shot so much. Anyways, man. we'll see you all soon. Cheers. Thanks, Dean. Shot, bro. <laughs> what is happening, fishers? 
just two guys taking a young walk across the coastline. Anyway, guys, it's a field of about 90 odd anglers. Not as many as I think we were expecting, but I think also we did expect that purely because of the conditions. The conditions haven't been good and I think people have been quite nervous to fish. I don't know if you guys can see behind us, but some really big sets coming through, some big swell. But uh, as always, the events are great and uh, I think we've put together an awesome event every single time. It's good to have even that many anglers come out. So yeah, we're expecting a good day. We're going to go mingle with the anglers and then we're going to start doing some data capturing. We've had two black steel come, come out, out so yeah. yeah, we had one at 56 centimeters, another one at 60 centimeters. We've had a nice spotted gully shark come out. So there are things coming out the water so far. Anyway, let's get in the back here. Go look for some food. the next spot. Food, yes. Food. Yes, hungry. Cheers. What is happening, Fisho? So we were just driving past and uh, we looked over and uh, Mr. Darren has got himself a beautiful Sylvia, guys. Check out that for a little beauty, guys. So we're going to get a quick uh, measurement in for Darren here yeah, and then enter him into the competition. You definitely, it's the first solver that we've seen today. Ah, beautiful. Trying to look for a flat surface here. I think try here by this. There we, we go. Guys, make your, sure your surfaces are all, always wet when you're handling fish, if you can. You on top here will be good, but Yeah, perfect. Okay, measure him up there, but. Either way, just, oh, just go like that. Yeah. Okay, fork tail fish. It's going to help Darren with the measurement quickly. Solid 72 centimeters, guys. You know, you want to, you want to take a, if you got a phone, take, 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 come take your photo to enter it. Oh, okay. So there we have it, guys. Well done, Darren, on a beautiful fish. Yeah. Uh, so what is your secret uh, formula to this guy this morning, Wood? Oh, just a uh, hard cockle. Oh, uh, nice. Leftovers from the other day, but yeah, yeah, something nice and do the trick. Something nice and smelly. Yeah, anyway, no, definitely. Wood, well done. This must have given you a bloody good fight. Very I see you're not fishing fun. very, very heavy at all. So <laughs> light tackle, yeah. good fun. Yeah, she swims away off strong, bro. What is happening, guys? And welcome to Winter Strand Recreational Club. We are here today for round two of the Bill Moria Classic, Classic Fishing Series. It is the Big Five. I'm here today with Don from Bill Moria, Dean from Untraceable, as we all know. And we've had a good day so far. I don't know, Don went for a throw earlier, so I'm going to hand yeah. over to Don and let him talk about the conditions. We've got about an hour until the lines are out. Um, it's been pretty challenging out there. I think the water is warm, but a lot of surge. We've had some big seas this week. It's calmed down a bit, but the east, east wind came up, so... Challenging conditions. We've seen some really good fish coming out there. There's been one or two nice fish. There, we've been targeting mussel cracker, black and silvers, and yellow belly chalyun. We've seen some nice chalyun come out as one well. Two, yeah. And we've seen a couple of the smallest gully sharks I've ever seen in my life, but there have been some fish coming out, and the guys have fished hard for them, I think. Yeah. So... I think the guys have done well to get fish today. Anyone really, has done really a good comp. Um, a lot of guys are saying they never normally fish this area. So it's quite nice to get them exposed to a new coastline. Uh, Winter Strand is one of my old ones. Um, yeah, you, you seem to know this place quite well. Yeah, we've, we've put a lot of fish over the years. Eh? It's a good, safe fishing ground. If you are in East London and you've never fished out this side, safe place to park your car. Um, no hassles in the rocks. You don't yeah. see any, any drama. And uh, good bluefish area, good black tails, good silvers. Certainly quite a nice variety of spots to choose from. Awesome. Um, so pretty good. Yeah, well, guys, we got a nice spread of prizes. Uh, thanks to Bill Moria for the fishing tackle side of things. Um, we've got some assorted caps, etc., from Assassin and Pro Hunter. But we've got some nice uh, 10 rolls of uh, Boss Slick Braid, which is a very popular choice at the moment. We reviewed it a while ago. Um, we've got some lovely rods as well, the Bluefish 14 foot 6. Um, a nice little uh, Hearty Rise Tanoshi as well, 13 awesome. foot, which is an awesome rod. 
Um, Adrenaline reel, which is a new one in the market. We're going to first class have in the country, but a, a nice solid little spec reel. Um, a few rolls of Kariki braid from Shimano as well. 100%. It's an incredible um, Japanese spec braid. And plus this, a nice scattering of stuff from Fish SA as well. So so it's been some very good tackle prizes from Bill Moria. And then there's some other sponsors yeah. as well. So a big thank you guys, Bree Mavis. Donated some uh, prawn pumps and some handmade gaps that he makes up himself. We've got uh, Olive Wood Estate that uh, handed us some nice gift cards. Crawford's Cabins, some nice gift cards from Crawford's Cabins as well. And then moving on, a big thank you to Topline, all the goodies, uh, the hardware goodies and stuff you donated to us. And then Plus Plant Hire, our cash prize, our two biggest cash prizes today, highly donated by them. So anyway, guys, a big thank you to all the sponsors involved. We do appreciate it. Yeah, certainly. We couldn't do this without you guys. And uh, yeah, looking forward to seeing the guys coming in later. Hopefully the couple of fish as the tide pushes now. Yeah. Make it more exciting. I think we've got an hour left. We've, we've, had about, we've had about 80 anglers, um, but we've seen a couple of silvers over 70 centimeters. Yeah, so correct. some nice fish coming out. I know one of the ladies is certainly charging for the win. I think she's in the lead at this, at this stage of the day. At this stage in the win. So yeah, it's nice to see. I saw a lady down the side there catch a nice big black tail just now as well. No, it doesn't count, but still, yeah, there's good, some nice, fan fish. Little blue fish and two um, come out as well. Yeah, and uh, some nice little black steam rust as well. Not monsters, but some, some decent so, size but, fish. But yeah. legal size fish, they're Absolutely, happy. Absolutely, yeah, no. So, been a good comp so far, and uh, I think the oaks have had fun, eh? So, 100%. And the weather's held, we haven't any rain yet, so... All it's good. Up. Anyway, guys, I'm sure the, all the fishing will be back sh shortly. Bar's nice and fully stocked. Food smells amazing. We'll see you all soon. Cheers. Yeah, see you later. Okay, guys, uh, firstly, uh, our first calorie we're going to go from like smallest to biggest is spotted gully. I must admit I've never seen such small spotted gully sharks caught in my life before. I didn't know they, they came out so small. But uh, one or two guys got some fairly decent ones and our winner of the spotted gully is a, it's a nice uh, RT Rise Tanoshi 13 foot. Quite a nice little bluefish gully type stick. And that is Dylan DeLange. Well done, but there we well go. Done. Enjoy that right bit. Okay. Khalyun, um, some nice Khalyun came out today, guys. They weren't any monsters, but I know quite a few posted some pretty good catches. And I must admit, the deliberation between first and second place was down to a centimeter. It got to the point where we actually measured from a cheek to the tail, just to make sure we, we fine-tuned the winner. So between three of us, we eventually conclusively our winner of the biggest Khal Yun, which is, what's the price for Khal Yun here? Refresh me. What is that? Yes. The bluefish. It's an assassin bluefish 14 foot six. Nice all rounder rod. And that goes to Greg Glutke. <laughs> He's making a habit of this, I see here. Good shot, bud. Well done, Britain. <laughs> there we go. Well done, Greg. Deserved it. And, uh, Top ladies left. Our then. top lady is, I'll try to get this right, Barusha McLaren. Is that right? Plus, Barusha. Well done. Congrats. Yeah, Barusha is a gift card from Crawford's Cabins, a voucher from Sovereign Foods, some really good braid. Okay. And don't go too far. There was one yellow belly caught today, and unfortunately that is a wee bit too undersized. I think it was like 42, 43 centimeters, and they were a 60 centimeter legal fish. Uh, so instead of throwing the prize for the yellow belly into the lucky draw as we said we would, there were two white muscle crack or silver that were also within a centimeter of each other. These fish like seem to clone around the same size. Again, lots of deliberation, measuring from cheek to tail, just to make sure we get everything spot on. And our second place muscle cracker winner. We've decided to give the the, rock the, 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 the yellow belly rock hood prize to. And I'm going blind in my old age and I can't read my handwriting. Um, you got it there. Yeah. Where am I? There we go. Goes to Darren Rousson. That's a nice adrenaline reel, some boss braid. Hope you enjoy that. 
Well, well done, done, mate. Man. Thanks. That was a close one. We're very close. Thanks. Okay, and then moving on to the bigger prizes. Um, black muscle cracker, black, black stem musk. We saw some good fish come out today. Um, again, no monsters, but some fairly decent catches all around. I hope you guys got a decent pull from some of those. Yeah, Keegan. Keegan, you caught the 69. 69 is Keegan. It might have come through on the different different number. <laughs> yeah. Well done. Sorry, Keegan, there's a well, cash money there for you, bro. Yeah, plus plant hire, there's two and a half thousand rand cash for you. Olive wood voucher. A nice little voucher for a round of golf. I hope you play golf or it's a good way to lose. Well done, well done, bro. <laughs> Sorry, I almost took your prize away from you, bud. Thanks, bud. Hey, I was getting my cut back from him just now. <laughs> And then, as, this, as we said earlier, there's a lot of deliberation. The biggest uh, white muscle cracker, and I must admit, a lot of honorable mention. Um, our winner of that, and I'll try to get the pronunciation right, Vanusha Marushka. 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 I'll get there eventually. Uh, you did very well, eh? Some nice catches. Thank you very much. Very well done. Again, there's two and a half thousand cash from Fastborn Tire and some nice vouchers. Hopefully some of the guys play golf. Okay, then, then the team prize, I must admit, wasn't too hotly contested this time because just not enough of us caught fish. And, but one of the teams had one guy that caught a lot of fish. And I think he contributed a lot, so you, you all owe him because I think he represented very well. And uh, Team uh, Pink Prawns, can we ask you to please come up? <laughs> that is obviously the secret bait today, guys. Pink Prawns. So that, that includes Dylan DeLange, Dominic DeLange, and Keegan Johnson. Well done, guys. Congrats. Okay, just don't run too far. Okay, there's basically four Bilmoria vouchers. Of two there we go. Each. You yeah. can decide who gets the the next one. If you mind just taking that for Okay, last one. Yeah. And that one. That's one. Yeah, and I don't know who the go. team captain is. Team, who was team captain? Team so captain. he's in charge there of the last, last voucher. Can we ask just the winners to get a group shot? He's going to move the camera back. Could we ask all the winners just to cruise up one more time for a group photo? Okay, guys, uh, just if you haven't entered our lucky draws before, basically. Our youngster will draw a number. We read your number. Hopefully you are here to collect your prize. If not, I'm afraid you move on to the next guy. Um, you'll see there's a spread of prizes here. If you call your name, you're welcome to choose one prize of your choice. Just a final word of thanks to our sponsors, Bill Moria, for the fishing tackle. There was a lot of other stuff as well. Um, the Fossil and Dean, yeah. you know the rest of the boys very well. Yeah, so Olive Wood for donating some vouchers to us. Uh, I'm, I don't want to get it wrong again. Plus plant hire, yes, I got it right this time. Uh, who else did we second, have? Second. Crawford's Cabins and Top Line Tools, guys. Sovereign. And Sovereign, Sovereign Foods. Foods. Thank you very much for all your and the, donations. And, the, and, the pumps, the pumps, uh, and Mr. Breen Avis for the pumps and the lovely gaffs that he made us, guys. Uh, while I've got the mic, uh, just a shout out. Uh, Moria Fishing Tackle and obviously with Untraceable, if you haven't seen us on YouTube yet, Please go click on us, give us a like and subscribe. And also to one of our fellow YouTubers, I think he's just snuck out the door. Yeah. Check out Hooking Juza from uh, Port Alfred. Give him a like and subscribe and give us some support, guys. I'm gonna hand it back over to Don, but thanks everyone for joining us today. Awesome day and we've got many, many more to come. Yeah, thanks guys. <laughs> okay guys, the, the next comp is the last weekend of May. Uh, we're changing it up slightly this time. We're going province against province. So it's national for shad as our target species. We'll start on a Friday evening through to a Sunday afternoon. Um, I know we don't all catch monster shad, but the prizes for this one are mega. Uh, a lot of them will be cash prizes for the biggest shad, but lucky draw prizes there, Shimano Twin Power. Correct. We've got a Hearty Rise Kayasuta. We've got an Assassin Horizon Championship Edition. And close to 100,000 in other prizes. So we've managed to put together some incredible offers there. And basically, even if you don't get a top three shared, you've got a pretty good chance of, of getting a really sweet prize. I don't know about you guys, but a Twin Power is a bit out of my budget. Oh, I'd love one. But I'd, I'd love one. It. 
I'd want so to watch watch this space, watch the Formoria Facebook page, check out all the info on untraceable fishing, and uh, watch for announcements in the coming week, guys. Thanks very much. Thank you, guys.